What's up, everybody? Marty Schwartz, GuitarJams.com, hanging out with a good buddy of mine, John Koneski, great musician, plays with Tenacious D, has his own stuff going on as well. I would never sell him short, just on the D. Uh, but uh, <laughs> anyway, uh, we're, we're rocking out. You did a lot of acoustic lessons in this session, so I thought yeah. it would be really fun to kind of get one of your, like, kind of little signature power zone licks yeah. you know what i mean yeah, like sure. just what you totally. do you know All right. <laughs> uh also just let you guys know i mean obviously we're out here giving guitar lessons uh on the inter worldwide interwebs uh you know guitar jams is a site with guitar lessons uh but my buddy cones here he's doing you're doing skype lessons do skype lessons that's right touring around the world touring with the d <laughs> <laughs> that keeps you busy yeah uh but like if someone wanted to like maybe reach out to you yeah, you can go to my website, uh, johnkoneski.com. You can okay. email me, john at johnkoneski.com. Okay, okay. Uh, and, uh, yeah, hit me up. Okay. All right. So I'm going to show you a little um, pull-off pull off slash hybrid picking lick here that's um, um, kind of fun here. So uh, here we go. Here it is. And just sort of a quick thing. Um, it sounds like it's a fast, you know, difficult lick, but it's not really that hard. It's a lot of pull-offs. So we're going to go. I'm actually starting by playing with my, playing that first note with my middle finger. Like that. So pulling off from uh, 8, 7, uh, 5. And then with the pick, we're going to pick the 8th fret on the, uh, second string. So this is all, it's all essentially based around your A minor pentatonic. There's obviously a bunch of extra notes in there too, but um, you know, you might want to be thinking about A minor pentatonic while you're doing it. So um, here we go. So real slow. So then when you go back, when you hit that note, when you hit that eighth fret with your pick, then you want to go back with your middle finger and pick that fifth fret again on the first string. So then we're just going to use that same pattern and just take it through a few different notes here. So, or uh, a few different strings, I should say. I'm sorry. Here you go. Now it's hard to do it slow, but you're going to want to pull off pretty much everything, and then, then when you backtrack, you're picking your fir the first string with your middle finger, second string with your pick, and then back to the first string with your middle finger. And then I'm going to do that pull off thing with my pick, so pick the eighth fret on the second string, and then your pick again on this weird outside note here, the, the blues note or whatever, on the 8th fret of the 3rd string. And then, and then this time around, I'm going to hit that same pull-off series on the 2nd string, but I'm going to pick it with my middle finger this time instead of the pick. So, so I can pick the, that 8th fret on the 3rd string and then middle finger on the 5th fret of the 2nd string. Then same thing, pick, then middle finger. So, real slow, I'm going to do the whole thing. slow again. So that's all there is to it. All right, I think that did. I think that covered it. It's a hard one to explain. I think you got it. All right. So, you know, it's always fun hanging out. 
hopefully you guys enjoyed it as well out there. And uh, you can always expect more in the future. Cool. All right. See you guys later.